This is a really complicated topic that they've put right at the beginning of your physics GCSE. I'm going to do loads of videos, but this is the, the, the A star booster one really explaining the theory behind it. When we have a liquid, we'll be able to have loads of particles, and they are moving around like crazy, constantly, constantly on the move. If this is our surface, every so often, a particle is going to get enough energy to, to escape the surface. Now, some of these particles might have enough energy, but they might just be going in the wrong direction. So loads of different particles are going to have um, loads of different reasons for not escaping, so wrong direction, enough energy but not close enough to the surface, or not enough energy. So we can have particles that have a lot of energy that don't escape, and particles that have very little energy that do escape. Now this is a really complicated part, and this is an A-level um, standard graph, not something I normally show to GCSE students. So along the bottom we have kinetic energy and up the side we have number of particles. And if we say that here is the amount of energy that you need to escape, so at this temperature, this is going to be the number of particles that escape. So even at a low temperature you are going to have the operation going on. If we increase the temperature we are going to shift the graph a bit. And we may shift the graph like this. So again, this line here is going to be the energy needed to escape. And what we've done by increasing the temperature is just the increased the percentage of the number of particles that have enough energy to escape. When we hit the boiling temperature, what we're going to be doing is increasing the um, kinetic energy loads and loads and loads so that loads the majority of the particles have enough energy to escape getting your head around this concept is really quite complicated but the really important thing for you to understand is that it is energy needed to escape from the surface and that can happen at any temperature Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any new videos. Check out my website, bromoscreen.com, for any new videos, all the videos sorted by exam board, the blog, and any um, extra advice there is. Any comments, questions, topic requests, or um, corrections below.